What's going on guys, we're coming at you with another MLB The Show 19 video. Today we are one win away from Division Series and Hall of Fame difficulty games here in ranked season. So we're going for 170 or more likes on this video. Subscribe if you guys are new. We are on the road to 33,000 subscribers, getting so close. Feel free to comment anything down below, follow on any of the social medias, or sub to the Fortnite channel if you guys want to down in that description. This is the squad that we're rocking with, and I'm going to let you guys know this. This is my rotation. I put Verlander back in. I put Wainwright back in. Like, I used to Grom earlier today and everything, and he did all right for me, but it's just... I'm not going to blame the cards. I'm going to blame myself, except for maybe Verlander, because personally for me, Verlander is really easy to hit and pick up his pitches out of his hand. But I'm going to give him another chance. And, and, and same with Wainwright. I'm going to really try to make myself focus on pitching and be better rather than just take those guys out and put a worse card in. So we're going to see how it goes. We'll see what we have on the mound today. I really just want to win this and keep my undefeated season alive for now. We're playing the Twitch.tv BNU3 Yetis, our opponent has 99 Duke Snyder 94 Alan Trammell he's creative player Benny Rodriguez that's awesome at catcher 97 Willie Stargell 90 DJ LeMahieu 98 Pedroia 91 Kenny Lofton 91 Andrew Jones we both have Wayno on the mound really looking to win this game guys look at that guys first pitch out there and this is what I talked about last video I suck with sinkers but I can't hit sinkers and it drives me crazy Maybe it's where I'm locating him or something. I'm hoping to have a good game with Adam Wainwright, though, today. And I'm hoping we can get out of this inning without allowing that run to score. There we go. Out number one, Ichiro able to catch that one. Benny Rodriguez to Ichiro, out number two here. Willie Stargell, another one to Ichiro. We're going to the bottom of the first inning. Wow. Ichiro. Oh. Man, almost a beautiful catch by center fielder. Wow, I think that's Kenny Lofton out there, almost making an insane play. Roberto Alomar, man, I got a good pitch to hit. I want to see if it's a sinker. I just, I just want to see if it's a sinker, because if it is, I hope it's not another one of those games for me, facing Adam Wainwright, where I just can't hit a sinker. Yeah, it was the sinker. Down the middle, too. Frank Thomas, wow. I feel bad, man. I really feel bad. I don't think that should be a hit. I don't at all. Dang, man. Runners on the corners. We're going to try to drive in the run, but I feel bad. Created player. No doubt about it. Three run home run. Joey Gallo stance continues to kill it for me as we take a three to nothing lead. Tony Gwynn grabbing himself a two out base hit here. Almost a beautiful play by the second baseman there. Let's try to get a two-out rally started with uh, with Ricky Henderson coming up to bat. Ricky Henderson grabbing another two-out base hit. No way, dudes. So I thought he was going to throw to first. I just assumed he was going to throw to first. I assumed he was going to get through, first of all. But then I assumed once he got it, he was going to throw to first. And we are going to be safe because 99 speed. But we're here. Top of the second inning. I'm glad we jumped down to an early lead. Now I'm hoping we can hold on to it and get Adam Wainwright's eight whatever ERA down at least a little bit. Cal Ripken Jr. leads off our half of the second inning with a uh, a single up the middle. So, Wainwright's coming up. I wouldn't mind another Wainwright home run here. Hitting 500 for me, 5 for 10 in his first 10 at-bats. Looking to hopefully keep it going. Adam Wainwright grabs himself a base hit. The infield was playing in for the bunt. He smokes it through the hole. Ichiro coming up. Nobody down. Man, look at that. Oh, that's not what I need to be doing, guys. If I want to win games, I can't be doing that with one of my best hitters. Roberto Alomar. I can't believe I just did that. Man, back-to-back -back hits to start the inning. And then I, I don't even advance the runners, okay? I don't even advance, and that's bad. But uh, at least we got some hits. I'm, I'm, I'm happy because we got hits, and it makes me think that the rest of this game, I can probably get more hits. Frank Thomas destroyed to did center field. Oh, man. Crush that one as we extend our lead to four in the bottom of the third. My creative player grabbing himself another base hit. Wow. I wish I would have chosen Joey Gallo's stance like weeks ago because ever since I chose that, he's just been crushing the ball for me. Matt Williams, another center field home run. Wow. My team's just going off today. Let's go. Tony Gwynn. Our third home run of the inning. What is going on, team? Oh, my goodness. 
Let's see what Ricky Henderson can do. Nope. Oh, at least he fielded it. Yo, nice play by Ricky. Oh, do we have him at second? Nah, not quite. That's a leadoff double here for Alan Trammell. And the top of the fourth inning. Benny the Jet Rodriguez coming up. And, uh, guys, that hit on a sinker. And it was down the middle. Let's just say that. It was, it, was, it was down the middle, so it wasn't a great location. But, man, my sinkers aren't good. They, never, they, they, they haven't been all year. Like, I, I, I suck against sinkers, so whenever I have a sinker baller, I'm always sitting there kind of like, okay, I'll throw sinkers because I struggle against them. Maybe other people will too. Nah. I've, I've, I've tried with so many different guys in Battle Royale in, in ranked seasons, and I just I can't do it. I'm tempted to walk Willie Stargell here, but I think I'm really just going to try to get, like, unhittable pitches and maybe, like, unintentionally, intentionally walk him with a hope of striking him out. That's kind of what I'm trying to do right now. As Willie Stargell over, Birdo, you got to catch this, buddy. You got to catch it, buddy. He's catching it. Is he going to go home? 65 speed is going to be close to the plate. And he's safe. So, our shutout's gone. Close play, but he's able to score. Tagging up on that uh, that out number two. DJ LeMayhew, 2-2 two, two count, two down here in the inning, and he's getting a base hit. One thing that I want to say, too, like, I know one of the reasons why I'm bad at, at pitching in general, but then with sinkers, is because I throw it too close to the middle part of the plate. Like, that's, that changeup right there was right here. So that, that's an issue that I struggle with is just leaving pitches out over the heart of the plate. I'm working on it, um, but I do realize that, that like that is a big reason why I have struggles on the mound is because I'm leaving pitches down the heart of the plate. Like I, I fully understand that. I'm aware of that, and I'm working on it. Trust me. And there we go. Getting out of the inning. Going to try to get that run back and maybe more in the bottom half of the fourth inning. Ichiro leading off our half of the bottom of that inning that we were just in. With a base hit, let's try to drive him in now. Get that run back. Get our lead back to seven. Roberto Alomar. At least it's not a grounder. I'm honestly happy that that's not a grounder because I didn't want to double play. I'm fine with just one out. We're going to see if Frank Thomas can do anything here. One down, one runner on. He's already two for two today. I got so excited. I saw the pitch coming in. I thought we were going to smack it. Who's my number four hitter? Is it my creative player? I hope it is. I really hope my creative player is up right now. That's what I want. It is. Okay, he's two for two, homer and a double. Let's try to keep it going. I'm excited. I've been having so much fun using my creative player recently because he's actually been doing good for me. Creative player going the other way. It could carry. I kind of doubt it. Yeah, two do Snyder. Adam Dunn, pinch hitting for Kenny Lofton, grabbing himself a base hit. If he goes to second, we might have him with Ichiro. Yeah, we got him. Look at that. That is a beautiful relay, rally, whatever you want to call it. I don't know if that's a... Either way, that's beautiful right there. Oh, Cal Ripken Jr. grabbing a base hit. Adam Wainwright going to be getting, I think, his third at bat. One for two today. Looking to make it two for three. Maybe smack one over the wall. That'd be pretty sick. Adam Wainwright. Ooh. Hit it hard right to the center fielder, though. I was really hoping that was a home run. I saw the pitch kind of coming in towards the middle part of the plate. I was thinking that maybe we could get a homer. Just It looks like we're on top of that one. If y'all if y'all looked at the feedback, that looked like we were on top of it rather than... Like, right on it. I don't know. It was just kind of strange. One down. Jake McGee on the mound for each hero coming up to bat. He's two for three. He's been smacking some dingers for me recently, guys. Getting that total up. I wouldn't mind hitting another one. Oh, man. I was I was really hoping it would, I would just hit one there and be able to be like, right here. As we got each hero and a 2-2 two -two count. Probably going to try a hit and run. And it works out. There we go. I'm not going to send the runner to, uh, to third. So, I guess it didn't really work out because I probably would have done the same thing anyways. But we got two on. One down for 99 for, or no, for Roberto Alomar. My bad. I was thinking Frank Thomas. I forgot he's batting number two for me, though. Roberto Alomar. No double play. No whammy. Let's go. I'm going to just try to send the runner home. Yeah, I was thinking we could be safe. So we got two on, one down for Frank Thomas, and then my creative player. I wouldn't mind a walk and then create a player grand slam. That'd be kind of sick. Frank Thomas. Probably no double play because of how softly he was hit. But my creative player with two down has two runners. In scoring position, I think he's two for three today as well with a uh, yeah home run and a double, just like Frank Thomas. Hoping he doesn't have the same fates as Frank Thomas just did. Slide, slide, slide. No, I tried to slide, but oh well. We got a run back in the inning, which I'm happy about. and uh, Or a run added on, I should say. And Adam Wainwright cruising along, hoping to keep it going. Oh, yeah. 0-2 count. Hanging a curveball like high in the zone. High in the zone. That was weird. 
Uh, hanging a curveball high in the zone. Lead off double for DJ LeMayhew here. Dustin Pedroia to Ichiro. Let's get a running start. Come on, Ichi. Dang. Is he tagging? Nah. I think he, were, I think he probably would have been gunned there. Ichiro has a cannon. Adam Dunn grounding to Roberto Alomar. Out number two. Wait, is that out number three? Oh, my bad. Out number three. We're going to the bottom of the seventh inning, guys. Trying to get some more runs here. Andrew Jones destroys that one to lead off the top half of the eighth inning. I should probably start warming up some bullpen guys. Like Adam Wainwright, we have a six-run lead to work with, but that could vanish real fast. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, and get some guys going in the bullpen. Probably 99 Wagner and, uh, and Dylan Batances here. Adam Wainwright gets his home run. No doubt about it off of the foul pole. Let's go. Oh, my goodness. DJ LeMayhew, two-out base hit here. In the top of the ninth inning, Adam Wainwright, one out away from a complete game. Not a shutout, sadly, uh, but one out away from a complete game. Definitely a good bounce back from his last one. And literally the only reason I put uh, him back on the... Okay. Come on, Ricky. There we go. Good catch, and that's the game. Literally the only reason I put him back on the team is uh, is because I got a few comments saying, hey, don't take Adam Wainwright out. Just, just use these pitches more effectively, stuff like that. I'm like, you know what? I could try that. I might as well. And uh, it ended up working out for me that game. So many home runs, though. So many home runs, including Adam Wainwright with a homer. Let's let's just go uh, go ahead and check real quick. I think it was like maybe six homers. Not nah, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. So creative player Frank Thomas, Matt Williams, Tony Gwynn, Adam Wainwright. Oh my goodness! More than half of our team hits a dinger that game. Two no doubters. Creative player and Adam Wainwright with the two no doubters. Man, that was fun. And it always feels pretty good to win. And uh, let's go ahead and check what our rating went up by. I'm assuming we're above 700 now. Also, Gilly Guy, our opponent from that game. If you are watching this video, man, shout out to you. GG's, that was a fun game. Our rating went up plus 29. So we are in to division series. And I'm hoping our games from here on out, assuming we win the next one and maybe the few after that, but I'm, I'm hoping at least our next game is with an opponent 700 or higher just so we can get a game on Hall of Fame difficulty. That's kind of what I'm hoping for. We'll see what actually ends up happening. But so far to start the season, we're 2-0, and I'm happy about it. It's going better already than my last season, and I'm hoping we can continue. I feel like I'm playing well right now, and I'm hoping that I can keep this going. And the goal right now, until we lose a game, is to not lose until we make world series i want to make world series on an undefeated run it's going to be tough i think i have it in me to do it i just need to focus play well every single game if y'all enjoyed the video be sure to leave a like subscribe comment anything down below feel free to follow on any of the social medias or sub to the fortnite channel down in the description i will see you guys next time thank you as always for watching i hope you have a fantastic rest of your day peace out